Hey, what's up? It's Alaska Stock Talk, and what's up? Oxygen Stock is what's up, and holy crap, I just wanted to get on here and say congratulations to everyone. Um, all of us longs, you know who you are, you've been here two, three years, um, averaging down, sticking with it, and you know, doing your own research, and now look where we're at, right? I don't know about you guys, but I was bought buying shares all the way down to 30 cents, and now we're at 90 some, 90 some cents. So I've literally doubled my money or tripled my money or whatever. I can't even think right now because I just woke up. It's still very early for me, but this is crazy, right? So I just want to say congratulations, everybody. It's been long overdue for f people to finally understand what's going on. 100% um, all the people that were making fun of us at 30 cents are now chasing this price action. So they're they're not, you know, they're not getting as much money as us. They're not, you know, it's we've all been telling them. Right, we've all been telling them that this was gonna happen, and it's finally happening. I mean, I know, right? We're only getting back to a dollar. There's a long way to go, but this is amazing, right? It looks like we're gonna meet compliance way ahead of schedule. Um, there's a huge volume gap between a dollar and a dollar eighty, so it, you know, it, it. Who knows where we're gonna go from here? in the short term, midterm, and long term. Things are looking very, very good for Oxygen right now. One thing that I did find this morning, um, let me see if I can pull this up here really quick, if not, oh well. Yeah, I don't, don't want to mess with it. But um, this morning I was looking at the World Vaccine Congress in Washington and we don't even have um, the person down who's talking at it just says senior representative so that that's pretty unusual for oxygen usually you know we have someone in there right away it's got a picture of Shankar or whoever is talking and right now it just says oxygen or senior representative that's it so that to me there's just not just that but all the things we've been seeing right and finding out it's all just piecing together finally and you can see the result a huge explosion in the stock price like I've been saying like many of us have been saying all the TA has worked out perfectly almost everything I've said has come to fruition well that's not true not almost everything we'll see with the partnerships and stuff but as far as the TA I'm talking about it's gone um, you know I called the moves the trend changes and that's the power of TA, right? And so, yeah, awesome Friday. Awesome, awesome Friday. Hopefully we hold this up, you know. At, we're probably going to have some retracement at some point, right? We can't just think we're going to go straight back up. Unless they do post some news, we could have, see some wild price action right now. If they were to post something right now, it'd be pretty wild. But... We'll see what they decide to do, right? I think who whoever the power at B is, probably Shankar, right? Because I've talked about before in the past that Shankar, he knows the stock market. Him and his son know the stock market. And I think they're going to play their cards just right. And we're seeing that. We're seeing everything play just right. Everyone who's bashed Shankar, and I've stuck up for him because he he is good at what he does. And he's good at a lot of things. And, uh, you know, it sucks that people can, couldn't see that. And they're missing out on huge gains, right? So congratulations, everybody. Amazing, amazing. Hopefully we keep this bullish trend going up, up, and up. That's what we want, right? Everybody wants it to keep going up. We'll see the all the shorts. I can guarantee you they're gone. They flipped and they are price chasing right now. They're they're all buying right now. All every single one of those people that were talking crap to us for years are all chasing this price action right now, and that's why it's shooting up the way it is. So 
congratulations, you guys. Pat yourself on the back. I know a lot of us probably still, you know, probably still aren't even. Uh, or in the profit, some of you are. So congratulations. Um, so if you're not, you're going to get there. All right, I think you're going to get there. I, I see Ocugen has a really bright future. So congratulations, you guys. It's Friday. Enjoy it. Have a good day. Just joking. I forgot I wanted to talk about um, setting up a way for when you're going to sell, right? You need to have a plan if you don't have one already. I've had some people message uh, message me saying, hey, if it gets to 25, I think I'm going to sell half my, sh half my shares, you know. What do you think about that? I think that's pretty risky. That's kind of what I was thinking initially. And... Um, I, you know, when it first went up those few times, I just kept thinking it was just going to keep going up and I wasn't selling at all. I think I sold maybe a thousand shares or something like that at the, at one of the spikes. Uh, but then I let the rest ride all the way down and then I continued to dollar cost average on the way down. And you don't want that for yourself this time, right? Maybe we don't go all the way back to 18. Maybe we go to nine. Maybe we, you know, maybe we go higher than 18. I don't know. But you need to have, you should, not, this isn't financial advice, but you should set up some sort of plan. Like I have, I'm using my, uh, like, Fibonacci tool, and then I'm looking at support levels and resist levels, and I'm going to, uh, I'll probably be selling some oxygen shares. I'm not going to sell completely out, that's for sure. But I'll be selling some chunks at these price levels to make sure that I get some profit this time. And that's what you guys should do too. Don't listen to anyone that's saying diamond hands or anything like that. I haven't seen that. But if that comes back, when we if we shoot up and everyone starts saying diamond hands, diamond hands, I can tell you those people saying that are the ones that are selling. That's what happened last time, right? Don't believe the diamond hand hype. Don't believe this stock is going to shoot up forever and ever. Take some profits, you guys. It's okay to take some profits and to make sure you're securing some wealth for yourself, right? That's why we're here, right? Don't let people try and guilt trip you into diamond handing when they're the ones that are actually selling. And you should be too, right? Have a plan, okay? All right, that's it.